rich Amazon marketplace. In this lesson, you're going to learn about how where you live has an impact on which Amazon marketplace you choose. Obviously, Amazon has numerous marketplaces around the world and they have plans to add even more. And again, obviously, the US marketplace is by far the largest. However, both the UK and German markets are growing at a rapid pace. So which marketplace do you choose? Generally speaking, we highly recommend you begin your physical products business in the USA. And this applies to nearly all countries our members live in. However, there are a couple of exceptions, which we will get to shortly. First, let's take a look at why we recommend the USA. Firstly, it is by far the biggest marketplace. So your products will have a much larger audience. Because it's the biggest, it also has the highest volume of traffic and sales. This means it is also easier to test your product and your marketing. This is because everything happens much faster when you launch a product. USA consumers trust online purchasing far more than any other country in the world. So if you are number one in the same categories in the USA and another country, your sales will be far higher than the population difference suggests. For instance, the USA has roughly five times the population of the UK. However, if you are number one in the same category in both these countries, then USA sales will be far more than that five times multiplier. USA consumers are also more accustomed to giving reviews and feedback. And also they tend to be far more objective in their feedback and reviews. However, if you live in an EU country, then there are options. Previously, we have always recommended the USA even if you live in the EU. However, over the past 18 months or so, things have started to change in the EU marketplaces. Both the UK and German markets have seen significant growth over the past 18 months or so. So it is now faster and easier to test products and marketing in both those countries. Most importantly, the competition has not grown at the same rate. So this recent disparity in growth between sales and competition means it is a much more attractive option. Now this new opportunity only really applies if you live in the UK or in Germany and to a slightly lesser extent other EU countries. This is because of the convenience factor. So when you add the convenience factor to the new growth in sales but not competition, it definitely becomes more comparable to the USA market. So let's take a look at the convenience factor. You can receive shipments before sending them to Amazon. So in other words, if you live in Germany, you can have your supplier send the products to you first so you can check them before sending them on to the Amazon Germany fulfillment centers. It will also be easier for you to get reviews because you will have friends and family in the same country that you can ask for reviews. Local terminology, this can be very important, even in the UK market, where obviously English is the first language, the same as the USA. But a lot of terminology is different. This is particularly important with the listing and the keywords you have. For instance, in the US, the most popular word for mother is mom, M-O-M, whereas in the UK it's mum, M-U-M, now, you may not think this makes much difference, and to a certain extent, in a title, it might not. However, when it comes to keyword searches, it definitely will. And that is because MUM, M-U-M, will have a lot more searches in the UK than the word MOM, M-O-M. And that is very important. Now, don't worry, you'll learn a lot more about keywords later on. It's just important you understand that knowing the local lingo is very important. Local tax. If you're in Germany, selling in Germany, making profit in Germany and paying your tax in Germany is much simpler than if you live in Germany and you're selling in the US because the tax is more complicated. And lastly, you feel more connected because the product you're selling is selling locally to you. So the choice. Here is our recommendations. If you live in the UK, then start your business in the UK. If you live in Germany, start in Germany. Now, for other EU countries, you can start in any of the three countries. In other words, the UK, Germany, or the US. 
but when you come to choose, make sure you take into account the convenience factor and how it affects where you might live and the market you choose. Now, this is only our recommendation. And to a certain extent, if you live in the UK, it's perfectly reasonable to go ahead and start selling in the US. However, we feel that because of the recent changes, that selling locally can make a difference. And remember, the choice is yours. And also, once you've launched your first product, for instance, if you're in the UK and you launch your first product in the UK, then once it's up and running and you've started to build a successful business in the UK, there's nothing to stop you going ahead and launching in the USA as well. So to recap, the USA is by far the largest market. If you live in the UK or Germany, your local market is definitely a viable option for sure and you will probably find it easier to get going. If you live in another EU country, then the UK and Germany might be an easier option for you. Just remember to check the convenience factor and how it relates to your country. If you live anywhere else in the world, 